Do any of you out there know how a climate control housing works? We have a climate control housing right here out of a Lincoln Navigator. We're replacing the evaporator core because the evap temp sensor was bad in it. How this thing works, how we direct air inside of here. We're going to pull in right down here. Uh, this is going to be sitting up like on the firewall area from outside air. We'll bring across the cabin filter. Straight in here, the blower motor is powering all this. It's pulling the air in from outside. After going through the blower motor, we're gonna cross the evap core and the heater core. And you see right here, we have our blend door. This is gonna direct air for the driver side. This one down here in this box is gonna direct air for the passenger side. So as you can see right now here on this one, we have it in the cool position because we're blocking all the air coming off the heater core. We're only taking the air off the evap core because we want it to be cold. After we come through here on the bottom side here, we're gonna direct air for the driver side. This side, we're gonna be on the passenger side. Over here, we have the mode door actuator. This is what's gonna control everything for the floor, defrost, and air. That is how a climate control housing works in a automobile.